Thank you for taking the time today to learn more about Persistent Suite, the world's fastest PC recovery software. The first thing I'd like to do is I'd like to demonstrate that um, the computer that I'm working off of today is a real computer and uh, this is a live demonstration. Uh, so I have an active PC here where uh, Adobe is actually up and running. Um, I can demonstrate things like calculator are functioning. I can demonstrate things um, such as paint which might be an accessory that you might be using uh, for day-to-day -day operations. And I can also demonstrate uh, the ability to get to the internet. And given uh, the network speed here, it might take a quick second to come up. But essentially demonstrating to you that this is a real laptop computer. Um, and the laptop computer, uh, as many uh, BYOD type devices or uh, remote uh, laptop users, uh, sometimes gets misconfigured or even uh, catastrophic failure due to security threats. So uh, in this demonstration the first thing I'll do is I'll simulate um, an attack on the system. Uh, many of you are probably familiar with uh, malware based attacks. Uh, today I'd like to just uh, show you a, an example of how malware can actually uh, disturb the user's working uh, production environment. So I'm going to install Security Shield. Essentially what Security Shield does to our computers is it, uh, it basically renders your antivirus software uh, useless. I mean essentially what it does is um, it will um, uh, bypass all of your security uh, um, solutions in a layered security approach. And as you can see from this download, Security Shield is actually infecting this machine with various forms of malware. And in this example, um, the traditional remediation effort would be to remediate the box. And uh, we are going to show you a disruptive technology that takes a different approach. So first what I'll do is I'll demonstrate uh, that we're going to activate this. And it's going to ask me for a credit card here, but I'm going to skip through that process uh, just for time's sake. And we'll close out this, uh, uh, this particular uh, malware infection. Uh, as we know, uh, from a security standpoint, uh, we have been infected and things are uh, bound to blue screen uh, as this is a, a live demonstration. So what I'll do now is I'll try to uh, open up Adobe uh, to show you that Adobe doesn't work due to the uh, malware infections. I'll open up Calculator. Uh, as you can see, uh, Calculator doesn't work. Um, I'll go back to my uh, rendering of uh, Paint. And as you can see, uh, Paint also um, is having uh, issues. And um, so the next step for the user is to actually log into the help desk to open up a ticket. And in this case, we'll go to the internet. And as you can see, we've been infected at your system ports and backdoors have been checked by a uh, visited page for external access. And so essentially, we've been, um, this machine is, has, has received an attack. And the only way, um, as many of you know, to fix this um, is to uh, re-image the box. And again, I'm, I'm in this vicious cycle here of an infection. And so what we want to do is quickly uh, go to the Start menu and restart this computer. And so what you'll see is preboot of the operating system. Persistent Suite will recover this system in less than 15 seconds. So as you can see, the boot, uh, the BIOS loaded. Now our software is loading and um, you know, we are now 12 years in the marketplace uh, with version 5.0 and as you can see 180 files were fixed. Um, we're already done fixing those files. Now the post boot agent which is going to provide the analytics is actually going to come up and now the Windows operating system will load. So now you actually will have with the analytics you'll actually have a file change report to show you exactly what files were infected and then which files were actually restored uh, with our software. So as you can see, maybe um, 10, 12, 15 seconds or so, the operating system loaded and uh, we are back uh, up in operation. And I'll just take a few seconds here for the system to uh, fully recover itself. And as you can see, uh, Adobe now works. 
I'll show you that calculator has been uh, restored as well. And we'll go to paint. And as you can see, paint is also up and running. And let's see if we can't get to the internet. And I apologize for the network connectivity. We're operating a bit slow. But as you can see, we have full internet connectivity. And this system has been completely restored back to the last known desired state.